hello guys how are you i hope you all are fine and well so today is the constitution day and happy constitution day to you all so today uh, we will look some important and you say facts regarding our constitution of india and it is very interesting you will feel very you know overwhelmed because i read this i researched and uh, collected some important facts and i you know uh, i am very proud to say that it was very interesting and you will also feel very very interesting so let's start the most startling of facts about indian constitution is that it was hand written note it was hand written note friends with 48 articles 12 schedules and 94 amendments not just that it was written using beautiful calligraphy by prem bihari Narayan Rajada. The pages were also decorated by artists from Santi Niketan. Next one is the Constitution of India serves as supreme law of India. And this is the foundation for establishing the structure, procedures, powers and duties of government institutions. It clearly sets out fundamental rights, directive principles and duties of citizens. The constitution of India was signed in two languages. First one is Hindi and next one is English. And none of their any other languages. So the signing happened while it was heavily raining. And this was considered as good omen by all the assembly members who had gathered there to sign final copy of the constitution. So actually what's happened when they, uh, they were signing the final copy of the constitution there uh, was heavily raining and they considered that this is the blessing of God and that's why you know this was successfully uh, signed by the uh, those, all the members. There were 284 members of the constituent assembly for signing the final copy of the constitution and this included 15 women as well. What an absolute example of women empowerment, no? From the time of independence. Exactly. The original copies of Indian constitution are preserved in helium field cases. Special helium field cases in the library of parliament of India. The original uh, the copies of the Indian constitution was specially, you know, kept in the helium field cases so that it does no, it don't uh, destroy or it don't it uh, preserved and for the safety purposes the draft was prepared after putting great thought really it was prepared after great research thought and you know great debate discussion when it was presented for debate and discussion there were 22 there were 2000 amendments really surprised no 2000 amendments made it before finalizing really what you know they have right they would have done this without any amendments or one two amendments but they took a very long time they debated discussed really you know we are proud to say that we follow the Indian constitution which is one of the really longest constitution of the world and the 2000 amendments really it is surprising 26th January 1950 became Republic Day of India but drafting constitution was complete exactly two months before this and that is not another than 26th November 1949 today 26th January had special significance in Indian history. It was on this day Indian Congress ceded fight for complete independence that is Putin Swaraj. And national Indian national flag was hoisted for the first time on this date only. Dr. Dr. B. M. Ram Bedkar was the chairman of Constitution of Committee and also first law minister of free india a jurist an economist and a social reformer and can definitely be honored as 
father of Indian constitution. Indian constitution is often called a bag of foreigners. Really, our leader took inspiration from several other constitutions. Like, the preamble of our constitution starts with we the people and this was inspired by preamble of USA, the constitution of USA. The national anthem of India was written by Rabindranath Tagore and the languages of the anthem at that time was Bengali but later on it was you know by Avid Ali translated into Hindi in 1911 which made present national anthem of India that is Zanagarman. The Indian national flag with tricolor chakra in the middle was conceptualized by Pingali Venkaya. He was actually from belongs to Andhra Pradesh, a city in the southern state that is Machali Patanam. So despite numerous amendments, the significant objective persists in integrity, liberty, quality, fraternity, diversity, and so on. The constitution continues to address duties of individuals and responsibility of a state to distribute resources to serve the common goods. Really, friends, uh, I uh, I was uh, you know I was overwhelmed while uh, reading this all the facts, and I hope you also enjoyed. And if you are knowing before this, then good. And if you, you are not knowing then please like video subscribe if you like this and must you know tell to your friends these facts and i promise they will also surprised after you know knowing these all facts so after knowing this constitution facts about indian constitution i was really overwhelmed and feeling to tribute and salute to those who committed nation with complete devotion dedication and it's time for every citizen of India now and human life in existence on the earth to take the same responsibility of building the nations. But you know, uh, very uh, sad to say that this is not happening.